Hello. Hello. How are you? I think the camera is not clear. How are you, sir? I'm fine, thank you. Okay, all right. And uh, can I get your name and where you're from? You kind of look familiar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I already joined you maybe for two times. Okay. If I'm not mistaken. By the way, my name is Maziar from Iran. Okay, wonderful. So I'm Michael from the USA, and yes, I remember your face. <laughs> okay. Yeah, thank you. So I'm going to give you some numbers and have you choose. What would you like? Mm, number eight. Number eight. All right. So I will cross off number eight. And today, all of the pictures are about food. Mm. So yeah, my favorite. Yes, everyone's favorite, right? So I will show you a picture, and you dis describe it to me. You know, the ingredients, what is it, and we'll talk about it. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, here we go. All right, here is the picture. Oh. Uh. Uh, what is it? Is it a, a kind of sandwich, maybe? Yes, it is. All and right. Include, Go ahead. Include, uh, includes maybe, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know the name of uh, what inclu uh, contents. Maybe uh, two parts of toast, maybe. Sure. Uh, tomato, some slice of tomato. Right. And what else? I can't recognize that. that what is it <laughs> exactly? Uh huh. Right. Well, I think you're mm. you're doing very well so far. On the top and bottom is probably toast, right? Toasted bread. And yeah. Then I, I and agree with you. Some uh, some cheese in the middle of the sandwich. Okay. Yeah, uh, I think some green. Some what? what? Some uh, kind of green vegetable, vegetables. I don't know what it is. <laughs> uh, I think it's probably lettuce. Or, it's, yeah, it's probably Maybe. lettuce. Uh, a big piece of uh, green lettuce. And I think this sandwich is a part of a bigger sandwich, and they uh, cut it to uh, many parts, maybe. Yes, I agree. And... It's a little bit difficult to see, but I think there might be, uh, it might be chicken for the meat. I'm not quite sure, but it's tough to see. Mm. But yes, this sandwich is very common. It's called a club sandwich. Yeah, and, we call it club too. Oh, okay. And exactly what you said. They take it, they you make know, it, they cut it into four pieces. Yes. Uh, uh, there are a lot of... Uh, English words, especially for foods that in Iran, we just call them by uh, their uh, English names. For example, a sandwich, we call it sandwich in Iran. <laughs> and club, we, we call it club, club, and jambon, jambon, and uh, love, love. <laughs> uh, I mean, we have a lot of uh, common uh, verbs in uh, foods, especially fast foods, uh, junk foods. Uh-huh. Well, that's good. It helps you mm -hmm. learn English quicker. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, and, and quick I have quick no question. idea anymore about this and I just want to eat it. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um what do we call the thing that is stuck through the sandwich to hold it together? What would we say? Uh I don't know maybe this is uh, piece of wood or I, I forget the name of this uh, thing I don't know what is it could you please right. tell me sure um, I don't know if there's a special term for it but we could maybe call it it's kind of like a long toothpick or else a, a skinny, maybe, skinny yes, stick, maybe. something like that it could be a long toothpick uh, I don't know uh huh and mm. yeah well, so it holds it together Mm. And have you ever eaten a club sandwich before? Yeah, it's so uh, common in Iran. We eat ah. a lot. Uh huh. Okay. But uh, our clubs are uh, uh, 
slender, a little bit uh, open. It's not thick. Ah, a little like bit thinner. This. Yeah, thinner. Okay. So, I'm going to switch back around. So, you mean the bread is thinner? Uh, the bread is a, a triangle like this. Uh-huh. And uh, it's a thinner. And just in, include just uh, maybe uh, on a slice a cheese or vegetables and what else a uh, what do you call it I don't know <laughs> what's the name but maybe uh, a sausage maybe the kind of sausage I don't know I forget the name <laughs> okay okay well but well done and thank, thank you. you thank you for coming live yep. thank you too hope to see you again next time okay mm. All right. Have a wonderful day. Thank you so much. All right. Bye bye. Good, a, Hello. Hey, how are you? Hello. How are you? I'm great. Thank you. How about you? Great. So today the theme is food. What would you like? Number four. Number four. Yeah. Right. Okay. So I'm going to show you a picture of some kind of food, and you tell me about it. Okay. Okay. All right. You chose number four, so here we go. Yeah. All right. So it's number four. All right. Okay. I can see a hand holding um, an ice cream. Um, a, a kind, of, you know, some paper has been uh, wrapped wrapped around the the ice cream and. Um, this, the ice cream is kind of melting because I think the weather is mm, hot there. And uh -huh. I can see something like chocolate or on the ice cream. Okay. And you mean this thing? Yeah. Yeah? What's that? Okay. <laughs> I, I, I agree. I think it's a big piece of chocolate or something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, um, so uh, what else? Uh, I can see something like a sea in the background, and the sky is blue, and um, uh -huh. some bushes, I think. It's not clear. <laughs> yeah, it's very it's, blurry. Uh -huh. Yes, really but very blurry. Let, and... But we let's get back to the food. <laughs> can you... <laughs> Can you tell me, what do we call the thing that holds the ice cream? They scoop it into what? What's that called? I don't know. I'm... It's, it's called the cone, the ice cream cone. Oh, ice cream cone. Oh, thank you. Sure. And usually you can eat the ice cream cone. It's edible. And it's just nice because then you don't have to hold it in your hand or in a bowl, right? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> And yeah, you know, I always uh, put some, I mean, um, I eat some ice cream, but I try to push some, some ice cream into the cone uh, to make it delicious. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh, right. And yeah. what, do we call, what do we call the thing that is wrapped around the bottom part of the cone? What do you think it is it? Mm. I don't know. For me, it's like some paper. <laughs> right. It's probably a, na a napkin or maybe a tissue. Yeah, yeah, right. All right. I'm just typing in the comments. Someone had said corn or cone, and I put cone. All right, so we have ice cream cone. And you said the ice cream is melting because it's a hot day. How can, you, how can we describe the action that melted drops – of the ice cream, I don't want to explain it, but they're touching the hand and they're probably moving down. What can we say? Um, probably we could say the ice cream is melting. No, it's um, melting down. down. No, rolling down. I don't know. Melting uh -huh. down his hand, something like that. Sure. We could say that the ice cream is melting and it's, we could say, oozing or sliding down his hand. It's, it's dripping onto his hand and the 
the droplets are oozing down, right? Uh, okay. So, yeah. what what does this person need to do to save the ice cream? To save <laughs> you, I mean he, uh, he or she has to eat it before it melts. <laughs> <laughs> right. Uh -huh. Or quick run into a freezer, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Right. Yeah, that's possible as well. But if I would agree with you, it's probably a hot day out, so there's probably no freezer available. And yeah, for for, for whatever reason, they waited too long to start eating their ice cream. Yeah, right. right. Okay, I'm gonna and switch back. Oh, go ahead. I I was about to say that the guy has a long nail. <laughs> ah. Long fingernails. Yeah, fingernail. Yes, you're right. And it, it, do you think it looks like a woman's hand or a man's hand? A man's hand. I. Uh -huh. I I agree. It seems to like that too. And it's like my hand. <laughs> <laughs> and how would we say? Uh, how would we describe? Whoop, how would we describe how his hand feels after all of the ice cream oozes down on top of it? What would we say? Mm, it's like sticky. Yes, exactly. So he'll yeah. if he touches another napkin or a tissue, it's gonna <laughs> get yeah, stuck. Stick to yeah. Uh huh. So it's... And what is the solution if your hands get sticky? What are possible solutions? You 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 need to wash it, or you have to um, you know you you. You can use um, tissue to uh, clean clean your hands. And what what if I'm feeling lazy and I just go like this? What do we call yeah, that? That's a better <laughs> choice, I think. <laughs> and how do we describe that in English? When you go licking your uh, hand? Yes, right. You could say licking your hand or licking each individual fingers. Either way, it's going to be a mess. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and the the there would there would, there would be a lot of um, microbes that can you know <laughs> get into your mouth. <laughs> uh huh. Microbes and bacteria, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. So, All right. Well, well you. done. Thank you for coming live. Thank you so much for having me. All right. Okay. Until next time, have a wonderful day. Thank you. Bye. Aha. Uh -huh. oh. Hello. Hi. Hi again. I am Yaku. Aha. Uh -huh. I remember you. This is your second time, right? Yes. Yes. This second. Okay. Oh, really... oh, okay. Yes. All right. So uh, choose a number, and we will talk about food. I have choose six. Six. All right, so we will cross off number six. Give me just a moment to find your picture. Okay, all right, here we go. Are you ready? I am very excited. <laughs> yes. Very excited. <laughs> yes, yes. Okay, all right, so number six is? Pizza. Okay. Pizza. I, uh, but I don't know... Uh, what we are doing now, <laughs> uh, I I said pizza. Uh... <laughs> uh huh. Sure. Well, how many? How many? <clears throat> how many pieces of pizza? How many pizza? Huh? Uh, there are two pieces of pizza. On right, right. and we can say. Right, we can say two slices. It's very common to say a slice of pizza. A slice right. of pizza, yes. And yes, can I you remember now? And do you like to eat pizza? Yes, uh, we Turkish uh, guys uh, like pizzas, but uh, in our traditional uh, food, uh, it's called uh, lahmacun <laughs> or pide.
like just just like pizza. Okay. Uh, al- almost al- <laughs> almost pizza, but uh, uh-huh. we we don't put mushroom. Uh, instead of we use um, kıyma. <laughs> Uh, like again, cheese? Again, just like um, just like köf, köfteyi de <laughs> köfteyi okay. de diyemiyorum okay uh, I'm just, <laughs> just putting in the comments two slices of pizza okay and can you tell me what is on top of this pizza what are the ingredients I I don't understand Okay. I so I didn't, uh, I didn't understand. So well, I didn't let's see. Hear you. Oh, okay. So we have the pizza, right? What what do they put on top? What are the ingredients? What kind of food? Yes. Of course, mushrooms. <laughs> uh, I don't see now, but uh, certainly. There are mushroom, ma- mushroom. <laughs> uh, I estimate. I estimate. Okay. Uh, of course, cheese. Cheese. Yes, of course, cheese. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I I don't know any more uh, food names. <laughs> uh huh. Sure. And they probably have pizza sauce, like tomato sauce. Oh. So yes, uh, maybe. Uh huh. Maybe it depends, uh, right? But I I uh, don't see clearly. Uh, right. What have what have on it? Uh-huh. Uh huh. Uh, maybe it's very uh, common uh, food, uh, supplement food, very common. Of course, tomato. Uh huh. Uh, uh, oil. Um, onion, um, onion. Onions is possible. Onion, yeah, onion. <laughs> <laughs> onion, yeah. yeah. Uh huh. <laughs> yes, I onion. think down in the comments right now, Alnia P says pizza base, tomato sauce, spinach, cheese, and basil. Can you see that comment? Yeah, yes, I I see it commonly. All right, I think that is. A good, good example of what's on this pizza. Um, the the green things on top, I think, are spinach. Spinach is a type of green vegetable. It's very healthy. Mm. Uh-huh. Uh, chili, chili, uh, a kind of spice. Ah, okay. Spices, chili. Sure, it's possible to have chili, chili pepper. Uh, chili pepper, chili sauce. Yeah. Uh, do 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 you like spicy food? Uh, yes, I uh, I like. Uh, our country uh, is very common food is uh, uh, chi köfte is uh-huh. its names chi köfte is very spicy and very hot. Uh, uh-huh. esp- es- especially uh, uh, people put uh, on top of this food um, hot sauce. Hot sauce. Mm. Uh, they are uh, asking you uh, if you want. Uh, they put more and more and more and more. <laughs> uh, and, and your your of of course your mouth uh, on fire. <laughs> Uh, uh-huh. Then you you drink iron uh, is uh, um, a kind of yogurt uh, yogurt supplement uh, uh-huh. uh, produced from yogurt, which and it helps to with water to yogurt, cool down your mouth and 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 mix it up yogurt <laughs> and water that mix it up is uh, uh-huh. called iron. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Thank, thank All right. You. So, thank you. Again. Thank you. To, to, today we we saw pizza. So it was two slices of pizza, right? A slice is one piece. So we had two slices. 
Uh, one, two. So two slices. And I think this was a cheese pizza with probably with pizza sauce, tomato, and spinach on top. And now I feel hungry. <laughs> <laughs> I am okay. all day hungry. I am all day hungry. I am such a dumb. You're always are, hungry. Eating, always hungry. We are eating pesto. Uh, ah, pesto. pesto. Uh, pesto sauce. Every uh -huh. day, every day pesto uh, is uh, again a common food, a uh, common uh, uh, Turkish citizen's food. Uh, and okay. And it's easy uh, and very uh, easy made of them, made, made it. Okay. 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 Very easy to make it. Okay. Uh, give me, uh, thank you uh, for giving me your uh live <laughs> again thank again. you again. okay uh, i i didn't uh, remember uh, your name your michael name. michael michael by the way by the way i am jakub <laughs> <laughs> great nice, nice to meet you <laughs> for the second nice time <laughs> yes <laughs> okay Inshallah. well I, I i i need to move forward because <laughs> there are other people yeah. waiting Yes. Take care so, of yourself. Take care of yourself. Okay. Thank you again. Thank you. Have a good day. Hello. Hello, Michael. How are you doing? Great. How are you? Can you hear me well? I can hear you okay. I think there's a small delay, but it'll be okay. Okay, good. All right. Here we go. And uh, one. one. Number one. All right. Number one. Okay, so today we're talking about food. So I will show you a picture. I'm a foodie person. What's that? I'm a foodie person. I like ah. to copy. <laughs> <laughs> everyone, everyone likes food. Okay, are you ready? Yeah. All right, here we go. All right, picture number one. Okay, it's uh, pasta. Okay. A fork that rolling pasta around it and tomato. Okay. And uh, it's a kind of uh, pepper. I think it's a pepper next to the tomato. The, the green thing? Yeah, I think it's a pepper, a green pepper. It, it's possible. I'm not sure, <laughs> I'm I'm not not sure, sure. about it because, <laughs> because it's not clear. But I th I guess that it is uh, green pepper. Uh huh. Okay. And what kind of pasta is it? Mm, pasta. We call it in our country pasta. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Well, to, uh, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead, go ahead, please. Sorry to interrupt. Oh, no problem. Uh, f for us, it we call it we call it pasta too. But pa pasta is kind of let me turn. Pasta is kind of the umbrella term that covers everything, right? And then you have penne pasta, you have elbow pasta, you have macaroni pasta, and this one is the long and stringy. It's called spaghetti pasta. Yeah, I don't. I I didn't know that because uh, uh, I I didn't know that there are a variety of pasta. Pasta, yeah. But uh, pasta is uh, very common and very popular in our country. Uh huh. And yeah. And it's it's pretty healthy and, too, right? Yeah, yeah. It's pretty healthy and have um very full of carb. Carbohydrates. Yes, carbohydrates. Yeah. That's right. Carbohydrates, yeah. Uh -huh. uh, and the ingredient of the pasta, ingredients are pasta, uh, potato, chopped potato. Okay. And ketchup. Okay. A, a ketchup that we uh, spread over the pasta. Uh -huh. And and uh, meat and yeah 
meet and meet yeah and uh, hot sauce uh, hot sauce okay all right yeah. I, i'm i'm going to show you the picture one more time and can okay. you tell me how do we describe how the pasta is attached to the fork okay all right so how do we describe how the pasta is touching or attached to the the fork pasta rolling over the fork uh-huh that's uh-huh we could you could say it's it's wrapped around wrapped, wrapped around, around or rolling, rolling over yeah both of them yeah wrapped right. around the fork right and yeah. there there are a couple of different options sometimes if you have the plate you take your fork and you twist it right yeah and yeah exactly yeah so you twist, twist it twist. and the pasta wraps around the fork or you could say you twirl you could also say you twirl your fork you twist it and it wraps up and then you eat it and you smile <laughs> yeah yeah exactly but, but but we we do not eat uh, a raw tomato with pasta uh huh you know as you can see in the picture there is a raw tomato uh -huh. on top of the pasta but we do not uh, uh, eat raw tomato with pasta in this way uh-huh i i agree i think it's probably for decoration yeah yeah it's for decoration yeah but we use the ketchup a tomato ketchup or a tomato sauce or pepper sauce on uh -huh. on top of the on top of the pasta yeah right with cooked cooked tomatoes yeah yeah i do that right okay yeah all right well thank you for coming live Have have you My already pleasure. <laughs> My pleasure already, Michael Have you already eaten you, pasta or have you had dinner or lunch already today Lunch yeah yeah I had lunch a, a couple of uh, hours ago yeah Ah okay because yeah. I I haven't eaten dinner yet and I'm getting more hungry <laughs> <laughs> Okay um, yeah I hope you have you enjoy your during dinner yeah i hope you have a great dinner all right yeah, thank okay you. thank you have a wonderful day thank you for having me it's my pleasure have a good one you too bye bye hello all right i can't hear you can you hear me yeah i can hear you can you okay. hear me now i can hear you a little bit better all right okay. can i get you your name and where you're from okay my um, i'm shahab i'm from iran okay nice to meet you i'm michael i'm from the usa are we're going to talk about food today okay oh uh, now i can't hear you anymore well let me let me uh, can you hear right. me right now can you i i think so let's try one more time Can you, can you can can yes. you hear me right now? Yes, okay. now I can. <laughs> We will figure <laughs> it out. Okay. okay. Can you choose a number? Uh number 5. Number 5. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay, so I'm going to find your picture. Okay. And I It's will an interesting, show you <laughs> interesting well, topic. I think food is always a perfect topic because everyone yeah. loves to talk about food no matter what the culture, right? Ooh, everybody yeah. is an expert <laughs> on food. Okay, yeah. here we go. Three. Number 5. Yes, here we go. All right, picture number 5. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, it's a hamburger. All right. So Can you What should I Yeah, what should I say about I'm not familiar with uh our sure. <laughs> question. All right, no worries. Well, you said it's a hamburger, that's a wonderful start. <laughs> <laughs> If you would have said pizza then we would have to fix it. But all we're going to do 
uh, we can talk about it. So you tell me what the ingredients are, and then I'll ask you some questions, okay? Okay. All right, here we go. Yeah. All right, so what are the ingredients in this burger? Uh, tomato. <laughs> Cheese, I think it's a slice of cheese, right? I think so, yes. Sure. And mm, bread, it's bread, <laughs> bread of hamburger. Uh huh. And there's a special word for the bread that goes with the hamburger. It's called, it's called a bun, hamburger bun. Hamburger bun, okay. I right. didn't know. And I'll type it in the comment, but keep going. Uh, is it pepper or I don't know? Um, let's see. Oops, sorry, I'm shaking it. Uh, what which one? What color? Uh, the green color. What is it? It's is the it... green color. Like here, here, and here. I uh, think it's it's probably leaf. lettuce. Lettuce. Oh, yeah, lettuce. It's lettuce. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. What else? Lettuce, tomato, cheese, uh, slice of cheese. I don't know. Right. Uh, slice of cheese. Pickle. Pickle. We yes. have. Do you have pickle? Pickle. Yeah. Right. The the kind of the dark green one. Right. Yeah. It's a kind of. Okay. Uh, it's a yeah. It's a cucumber that uh, keep in salt and made and it's called. Uh, Pickle. Yes, exactly. It used to be a cucumber, but now it has mutated. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, great. Right. It used to be a cucumber, but right now it's pickle. Right. What do we call the white thing that goes all the way across? What do you think? Hey, it's onion. <laughs> yes, a white <laughs> onion. That's right. Uh huh. Yeah. And how yeah. about do you the, the yeah. go ahead? The, I I want I want to ask you the the top of bread, it's uh, this spot. What do we call in English? Uh -huh. they're they're called sesame seeds, and sesame I'm gonna type seed? it. I'm gonna type it into yeah. the comments. Uh, sesame. One second. Sesame. Yeah. In seed. Persian, in Persian, we called it konzid. It is konzid. <laughs> uh huh. Uh -huh. Okay, it's very common with the hamburger bun to have a sesame sesame yeah. seeds on top. Okay, um, under the top bun, there's some white stuff. What do you think that is? Not the onion, but above the onion. Above the onion, is it leaf or kind of? Uh, well, so it has the the lettuce, but there's some white stuff. And I think it's probably mayo, mayonnaise, but like a white. What do you think? I don't know. The white thing you should, you said? The white thing? Well, let's see. There's two white. There's the white one that goes all the way across. Yeah. And then there's also underneath the top bun, there's some white stuff, white stuff, white stuff, white stuff. Kind of like a cream. I think it's mayonnaise, mayonnaise dressing. Sorry, one one second. You were broken up. I I couldn't oh. understand what you said. Sure. Uh, yeah, you're, the, you're back. Okay. Okay. So the white the white one that goes all the way across is the onion, okay. but the yeah. stuff the stuff like this 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 I think is mayo mayonnaise. It's kind of a mm -hmm. like a cream. It's like made from oil and. Uh, I don't really know what they make it from, but it's kind of like a sauce, and it tastes nice. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's kind of sauce. Yeah. Uh huh. Ketchup. Okay. Ketchup. Ketchup sauce. Sure. Well, um, yep. On the red stuff, they have the ketchup. That's right. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. All right. So that is a burger, and would you say a burger is healthy or unhealthy? Mm, sure. Absolutely, it is unhealthy, <laughs> but. <laughs> Um, this is fast food. All all of us love fast food, and mm -hmm. although it is it is um, unhealthy, but 
all of us uh, eat uh, that for uh, for example me I, I would like to have uh, fast food one uh, at least uh, twice a week two or once a week I uh -huh. yeah uh -huh. yes I agree it's not very healthy well I I need to move forward thank you for coming live thanks it was the first time I just followed your page I I didn't know. Uh, so thanks. What was your name? Mike? Michael. 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 Mm -hmm. Thanks, Michael, for having me. And okay. Have a great day. Thanks. You too. And you're welcome to come live in the future. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Sure. I will participate and join. Thanks. Have a great All right, day. Thank you. Bye bye. Thanks. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hello. Can I get? What is your name and where are you from? My name is Mehmet Ali Metin. Uh, I am from Turkey. From Turkey. Okay. A lot of people from Turkey. All right. My name is Michael. I'm from the United States. Very nice to meet you. Okay. So. Nice, nice to meet you. Today so, we're going to talk about food. So I need you to choose a number. Uh, I am choose three. Number three. Okay. Yes. All right. So I'm going to show you a picture of food and you tell me what you see, okay? Okay. All right, so number three. Let's take a look. Here we go. Yes. All right. Oh, delicious. What do you see? Uh, I don't know. Okay. Well, tell me what colors do you see? Uh, red uh, and black. Uh-huh. Right. So, these are all called berries, right? They're called berries. And how do you think, how do they taste? Uh, strawberry. No. Uh-huh. Uh, uh huh. Right. From they're what? helping. They're from, helping you from... in the comments. They're saying strawberry, blueberry. Sure, if you guys can help him in the comments, that would be great. Uh huh. Yes. Yes. All right. So, um, and the blue, blue center, center is blue color. What is what is blue color? Ah, the blue ones are called blueberries. Blueberries. Uh huh. Okay. And, okay. And the big black ones are called blackberries. Yes. And I think the the red ones. I'm not sure if they're strawberries or there's another berry called raspberries. So they're all they're very sweet and they're very. Let's see. Let me ask. Do do you like to eat food like this? Yes, nice. Uh huh. And how does it taste? Would you say salty? Would you say sweet? Would you say sour? What do you think? Uh, I don't know. Uh, we probably would t taste sweet, or if they're very new and they're not ripe yet, if they're not ready to eat, they might taste kind of sour. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And if sour, sour means that you eat it and you're like, Ooh, that means sour. <laughs> yes, yes. yes. Uh -huh. And sweet is just like, ah, it's wonderful. And do you have a lot of food like this in Turkey? Yes, yes. Uh huh. Uh, nice, nice fruit. Uh, uh huh. Yes, it's very delicious. And like they say in the comments, it's very healthy. Let's see. I can do it for sure. Says they are so healthy. Yes, they're very good food. A lot of good vitamins. Uh oh. Okay. 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 Well. All right. Well, thank you for coming live. It was very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. 
Okay? Have a wonderful day. Have a wonderful day. All right. Bye-bye. Hello. Good afternoon. Or good evening. I think it's evening at your time, at your place. Good night, but... <laughs> oh. It's... It's afternoon here. It's uh, around uh, 6 uh, to 10, I think. And where is here? Uh, case A, Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia. Okay. Yeah. All right. So I have two numbers left. Which one would you like? I'll choose number seven. Number seven. All right. And have you been watching? Do you know what today's theme is? Yes, it's about food. I like it. It's an interesting <laughs> topic. <laughs> who doesn't loves... like food? Yes, who doesn't <laughs> like food? Right. And I find no matter where you go in the world, everyone is an expert too, right? Because we have very strong opinions. Mm -hmm. Yeah, of course. Okay. All right. So I'm going to switch around. Are you ready to go? Okay, I'm ready. All let's right, go. let's do it. All right. So you said number seven and here is the food. So what yes. do you see? This is like uh, food, a kind of food which we eat uh, in breakfast, okay? So it is, uh, what, it is eggs, uh, mm -hmm. or, uh, what do we call it? It's, uh, what? I don't know, but that kind of, it's, it's not mixed. It's, ah. still, it's like uh, the eye of egg or something like that with, uh, with right. toasted bread. Aha. Uh -huh. And we can say these are yeah. eggs sunny uh -huh. side up. Sunny side eggs. Sunny side up. Sunny side up. Okay. I, I, it's my first time to hear about that. With uh -huh. the toasted bread. Right. Exactly. So we could say there are two, they probably fried, fried eggs. But they didn't yeah. flip them. They didn't flip them over too much because they didn't want to destroy. What is the yellow thing called in the egg? What do we call that? I don't remember the white egg and the yellow egg. The yellow uh, or uh, the I yellow, forget. I, yeah. The yellow part is called the yolk, and I'm going to type it into the comments to make sure it's easy to. There, I put it. I put a red apple by it. It's called the yolk. So the, the egg, egg yolk. Okay. Uh -huh. The and egg yolk. Yes, I have heard about it, but uh, I forgot uh -huh. about it now. Okay, the so egg. we could say the style of these eggs is two eggs sunny side up on toast. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Sure. And your information. Yes, and they are. You... Mm -hmm. Go go ahead. They are fried. Uh, they uh, put a little bit of oil on a plan on a pan. Uh -huh. Okay, then they put it. Uh -huh. uh, sometimes they uh, spread a little bit of black pepper uh, and uh, salt on it. Sure, sure. And what happens if you don't put oil on the pan? It will burn down. It will stick on the on the pan. Right. It will and never get a, a, get out. <laughs> it's a headache to try to clean later, right? Yeah, of course. Uh huh. And how do we describe when you hold the egg in your hand, what do you have to do to get it in the pan? What do we call that? Uh, we have to break the egg on the pan to break the crust of the egg, or, okay, and boil or uh, put the egg in the pan. Right, right. You could say sometimes what they do is, uh, I'm going to turn back around. Okay. Is you take, you take the egg and then you kind of knock it right on the side to crack it, yes. and then you put knock it over. And crack. It. Uh huh. You crack it first, crack the egg, uh -huh. and then then you pull it open or you break it open, right? And then it pours out, and then you can start to to fry mm -hmm. the egg, right? I say that shortly we break the egg and pour that something uh, on the pan, in the pan. Right. Right, and what do you think they started to cook first, the toast or the eggs? It has been the toasted that uh, toast uh, first, then the eggs. I don't like to eat uh, the eggs like cold. I like it hot. Uh huh. Uh huh. And okay. would you 
Would mm-hmm. you say is is this a common dish in your country? Yes, we do it. And it, do it is you... a common during uh, uh, the morning. We eat it in the after, uh, in the breakfast. Sure. And do you put the eggs on top of the toast or just put the toast beside the eggs? We put it beside the eggs. We put the uh-huh. eggs on a plate by its own then we eat it with the bread. Hold on. Okay. Uh-huh. Right. And for these eggs, if we took a corner of the toast and we poked the yolk, how would we describe what happens next? Then it will like uh, melt down or uh, go out. Melt down, I think. Is it uh, called melt down? You could Let's say pour out. Could, uh-huh. We could say pour out, we could say run out. Yes, we'll run out. Because right. it is not, it is not very well cooked. Right, right. So we could say the yolk will run out onto the plate, and right. And then, how how do we describe how we use the toast with the eggs? How would you eat the toast with the eggs? Dip, dip the toast, uh, and eat dip. I think it is called dip. Sure, that's one option, and also in the comments, Alnia P says dunk. We could dunk the toast. Dunk, <laughs> dunk kind of the like, toast. Okay. It's possible. Mm-hmm. Thank you for these new uh, new informations for me. Right now, the eggs is called sunny side up eggs. This kind. Right. So it's very common if you walk into a diner or a restaurant in the U.S., maybe even around the world. I'm. And you could say, "All right, I would like two eggs sunny side up with toast on the side." And okay. this is, if you said toast on the side, they wouldn't put the eggs on top. They would, you know, put it on the side, maybe in a different plate. But, yeah, two eggs sunny side up. Mm-hmm. Thank you, thank you really much. Okay. It was nice talking to you, teacher. Yes, likewise. Have a wonderful evening, right, or late afternoon? Uh, late afternoon here. Okay. My country. All right. We always okay. learn new things from you. Thank you, Teacher Michael. Great. I like and thank contact you. with you. Good <laughs> thank night. Thank you for coming live. Okay, right. thank you. Good night. Bye-bye. Good night.